Hi guys, and welcome back to Andy Mirror Dimensions. So remember that we were going to um get more um replicanti so that this can kick in. Well, it's much higher than one point zero five million now. So yeah, we can get the seventh infinity dimension crunch for a lot more infinity points, and then get all of these, and then um. We don't need to, but we'll get the replicanti upgrades for later, and we'll turn this off. We'll get our boosts manually, and looks like we can get a lot of them, and um, I'm going to go for three eternity points this time, which is E429 infinity points. That's sort of a lot, but it's not too bad. So, um, I just, um, yeah, I just, um, we're gonna need replicated galaxies, but it's fast now, so. Okay, that's the eight infinity dimension. And we can already crunch for a lot. I'm not, I shouldn't be holding D. Um, but I guess we can. Wow, that's eighty-one galaxies without boosting. So we're gonna we're gonna skyrocket past E three hundred eight infinity points. And probably get to E three forty nine for the two eternity points quite easily, but then after that we'll need replicated galaxies, but they'll be faster. Like we're talking less than ten minutes faster. I'm forgetting to buy these, that's why it's slow. Um and I can also wait I can't. I can get more dimension boosts. Wow. I al The eternity button's already here, but I'm not going to do it. Yes, it's tempting, but I don't care. So, 84 galaxies. And... There we go, 88. Um, E324, okay. We're still going strong. Oh, and we can probably buy more time theorems. And I guess I'll just get like, um, I'll get this to make the replicanti time walls faster. You keep half your replicanti galaxies on infinity. Um, um, so yeah. I think I accidentally clicked F, and that's paying respects, but I don't care. Okay, E330. Two eternity points on the first eternity is possible, but I wouldn't recommend it. Just so you know. And, wow, look at our infinity dimensions. And our time dimensions. We're up to like 500,000 time shards and 47 tick speed upgrades. And, okay, it's slowing down a little, um, because I have all my infinity dimensions and it doesn't feel all that fast, but maybe, just maybe, I'll get Galaxy 90 and then it will be fast again. Yeah, E349 won't be hard. Like, once we're jumping like two or three orders of magnitude, I'll start getting my replicated galaxies. And the next eternity milestone lets us keep our auto buyers, so the grind to break infinity will be non existent. And then there's the replicant galaxy auto buyer. And then I keep my infinity upgrades. And then I just. This one's really good. Um. Okay, we're up to E343. Infinity points.
and I'm trying to hold M to get my galaxies a bit faster, it's not doing anything. So yeah, here's 86 without boosting. And looks like, okay, I need to get these. Okay, 90. That's E3. I don't, I don't think it should be this slow at this point. Like, usually you don't need replicated galaxies until, like, E370. Whatever, it's only my second eternity. I never go for three on my second eternity, so... I've noticed that I'm close to 91 galaxies. So I'm just gonna... Um, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna crunch again. I'm almost at two eternity points. But... <laughs> I'm going for three. So I'm going to get E349 and then I'll start using replicated galaxies. We'll see how many I... Okay, E349. Um, so, I'll get one here. Oh, I just realized um, the... It, this will, like, this will have to build back up, but hopefully it won't. Okay, I'll try and get E350. I can. Let's see. Nine minutes. Okay. Um. So, we're going to get two, because there's no point only getting one, because we can keep half of them. So we'll start with two. Or maybe we'll just get six. So I will... Um... I'll just sort of... See you guys... Um... Each Rebel Candy Galaxy. Sort of like before. I'm gonna do an achievement attempt. It's for the ludicrous speed achievement. There we go. Um, it's for being crunching for E200 infinity points in two seconds or less. I'll also try to get the sum of my infinity times down for this achievement. It's slightly different in the regular game, but that doesn't matter. So, I'll, I'll just go like that and try infinity challenge um, five. I screwed up. Whatever. Um. And then. Yeah, this is the strat for. Oh, by the way, I want to get E100 bulk buy. I completely forgot about that. So yeah, I s I'll see you once we've got that. Okay, guys, I'm back. I've got E100 bulk buy. So I'm going to start Infinity Challenge 5. That one was easy. And I'm going to set the priorities back to normal. And then I'll try the slowest ones, which are 4, 6, and 8. We won't need any special strategies for any of them, but they'll be slow. We can get this, I guess. Okay, what if I just... Um, what if I just get, like, two galaxies? I'm, yeah, I'm running four. Now I'm, now I'm gonna try six. That was easy. Now eight. Oh, it's a bit harder. We need, like, four. Six, I guess. Six galaxies is enough. Now let's start the challenge again. And then the rest of them are easy, so I'll just um seven um three two one, and that's the achievement. Yes, this is hell. 
in the normal game it's 6.66 seconds, but because we did this one, it doesn't really matter. And now I've got all the row 9 achievements. And so, um, it was sort of, um, there is another achievement related to infinity challenges. Um, these don't exist, and, um, yeah. So we're gonna exit this, and then we're going to set this back to, like, a million. And, yeah. So, unfortunately, the replicanti reset when we do an infinity challenge, but I will sort of see you guys every nine minutes. And that nine minutes will get faster, and this is, and we'll also only have to do three replicated galaxies instead of six. So, yeah, I'll see you in nine minutes. Okay, guys. I'm back, and I have 80,000 antimatter, which means I can buy another time theorem. And I'm going to save up for this, because it will be immediately helpful. And then, when we finish the eternity, we're going to get three eternity points, allowing us to get two of these. And then, because we'll get this as well on the way, we'll be able to afford this study, which is really good. And then my ac my plan is actually that on the next eternity, I'll get e five hundred infinity points, which will get me another time study no theorem on each of these, allowing me to get this time study, so that we won't have to grind through the beginning of the eternity, and it will be even faster. So yeah, that's my plan, and I will see you guys later. I'm currently on three replicated galaxies of this run. I need to get six. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm just going to show you the fourth replicated galaxy because I found a little bit of a loophole. Because if I wait until six replicated galaxies crunch, then get, then get three more, that's nine in total. But if I get four crunch, go down to two, and then get four more, that's only eight. So it's actually faster if I do this, and then I crunch now, and then get this, this, and this, and then everything here. So, yeah, and I will, it's only like seven minutes now, so yeah, I will see you guys at the end of this run. Um, okay, I should really, um, okay, it's 86 galaxies now. Mm, yeah, um, there is a thing that will solve this problem. It's the Eternity Milestones. But anyway, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, I'm back and I can get my sixth and final replicated galaxy of this run. So, I'm going to crunch for E388 infinity points. And I did buy one of these while I was gone because I generated the infinity points I needed. And I'm going to crunch here and um yeah so um i'm gonna buy that just a lot of levels of everything and of course the replicanti upgrades so now it's only like five minutes for each replicated galaxy thank god the timers are getting shorter i hate them so yeah, I'll see you after this run. Okay guys, I'm back and I am now able to get my 6th replicated galaxy. So, I can now get E400 infinity points. And so I'm going to get this, 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 and this. And now we're down to 4 minutes per replicated galaxy, so it's much faster. I'm also going to get these infinity dimensions, I guess I can get that, and then the rest of these, and then we wait. So yeah, I will see you guys in another several minutes. I'm going to go here, and I just um realized that we're going to just cross um, 50 milliseconds in the interval, so I'm going to buy that.
and then will basically never be affected by the interval limit of 50 milliseconds because the limit will be 1 millisecond. So yeah, I'll get that. And then, um, of course it won't help us immediately, but that's fine. We're still going. Um, yeah, it's still giving me, giving me like a lot of orders of magnitude. And in fact, our max verbal candy galaxies is up to 7, so I could get that if it's slow. So yeah, I will see you guys um in a little bit. Oh wait, another galaxy. Let me just get my dimension boost for a while. Okay, so we're close to 100 galaxies, but... Um, there's an even harsher scaling at 800, so yeah, I'll... Finally, I'll see you guys later. Well, not later, but like, I'll see you guys in a bit. Like, I'm not ending the episode. Okay, guys, I'm back, and I decided I'd go for seven replicated galaxies, which is the max. I'm gonna get my dimension boost, and I want to show you something distant antimatter galaxies. So the cost scaling starts to accelerate. It's not too bad at first, like I said, but it exists, just in case you were wondering. And here we don't really have any time theorems we're going to be able to buy until the end of this eternity. I'm going to crunch here. Um, yeah, I'm going to crunch. Get these. So now it's only three minutes. The next run should do get us to E429 infinity points. We can get this, this, all these, and then... Yeah, we're good. So, yeah, I'll see you guys at the end of this run. Okay, guys, I'm back. I can get a 7th replicated galaxy, but I don't know if that will get us to E429, unfortunately. Yeah, not quite. Um, But we're close. We're probably going to be able to get it on the next run. Oh! Wait a minute. I can get three eternity points anyway. I did not know that. Why am I even buying my stuff? I'm going to eternity here, and then you'll see what we're going to do. We're going... Oh, no. Oh, my God, I forgot to... Thank God. So before doing the sec second eternity, respec your time studies. And this is what respec does. So you'll be see so it will reset your time studies now by two time floating point error. Okay, I'll just put in the console um player dot eternity points equals new decimal two. And now I can buy the time theorem. I wasn't cheating, I was just fixing a floating point error so that I should get the time theorem that I should. Now, I'm going to buy these time studies so I can get 42, and it's pretty OP. So yeah, hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys later. I'm sorry about the reloading, but yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye!